So when a startup is starting out, most startups will not have the resources to hire on full-time or even part-time employees. You will use contractors. And when you're using your contractors, it's really important to have every single contractor sign an agreement that has work for hire language that assigns all their intellectual property to you and your company, actually to your company. Um, because if you don't have that specific work for hire language when you're hiring a contractor, the intellectual property's ownership actually belongs to the contractor. If you have not signed anything with a contractor before the work commences, it's fine. You can also go to your attorney and you can assign the IP rights from the um, contractor to the company with a specific contract. So whether you get your contractor to sign an agreement before starting work or after, it's really important to take these specific steps to ensure that the intellectual property um, that your contractor has been working on belongs to your company.